Joining us now to tell us what the future holds for baby making uh, is a fertility specialist and medical director of Pacific Fertility Center in San Francisco. Please welcome Dr. Jeffrey Shear. We're glad to have you Dr. So it, it's changing. I mean, one thing that Jerry and Al were saying to me during the break, how different it is than 30 years ago when they had their children. And it is quite different. Dramatically so, yes. Yes. You can do almost anything, even if you've had a hysterectomy. Well, certainly third-party parenting, which is where a third party helps uh, another couple have a baby, uh -huh. uh, either through ovum donation, as this uh, young lady has just told you, or through surrogate parenting, as you've just heard here with in vitro fertilization, has extremely high success rates. Um, it seems that um, surrogate parenting is taking on a new turn that people are doing it within the family more. Because I remember in the mid-80s, late 70s, I did several shows about this, but people were doing it outside of the family. But after Baby M, I think a lot of people got Correct. a little wary about it. Correct. But that's traditional surrogacy. What we're talking about here is in vitro fertilization with third-party parenting, with surrogacy and ovum donation. As I said, the success rates are enormously high. There are over 60% pregnancy rates in certain centers, and this is very, very good. And uh, I think for the first time, we can now possibly look at couples and say, you have an overwhelming chance that you will get pregnant if you follow this course of third-party parenting, surrogacy and ovum donation. It's more for the, for, the, uh, for the woman that is going beyond the age of 40 and menopausal women and uh, it, for, as far as ovum donation is concerned, and surrogacy is more for women who have unhealthy uteruses or do not have a uterus, so that somebody else will carry the child for them. But certainly, uh, it is many more children, many more sisters are helping sisters, and mothers are helping daughters and sons, and, uh, but there are a large number of surrogates that come out of agencies still. Mm -hmm. And I think there's nothing wrong with that. Women are helping women have babies. I think it's wonderful. Okay.